video. In this video, we're going to talk about another career path in tech, and this is UX UI design. So let's talk about what UX UI designer actually does and what is UX and what is UI. UX stands for user experience. UI stands for user interface. In other words, your interface, your um, what you see on the screen, your website, your mobile app, and your user experience is how everything is flowing, if everything is intuitive, and as if it is really easy to navigate your app. So if this is user experience, a user interface is what you see on the app. So this is the gist of UX UI. So what actually UX UI designer does? UX UI designer designs your UI and your UX. So UX UI designer, uh, they normally come up with the UI for your mobile app. You kind of business describes what the purpose of the app, uh, what the app should do, and designer puts together a design how it's supposed to look like based on the requirements. Um, they provide user experience, they um, contribute to the discussion um, what the user experience should be, what the UI should be. They work closely majority of the time or they should work closely with uh, software developers, with front-end developers, because sometimes UX or UX UI uh, design may be really difficult to implement in, in your mobile app. So there's always like a level of negotiation. Hey, we have really good UX UI design, but to implement it, it's going to be really, really expensive. It's going to take a lot of time and it's going to be really complicated and potentially lead to other problems in the mobile app. So that's what UX UI design does. <laughs> So, what do you need to know as a UX UI designer? Well, the obvious thing you need to know and understand the design. Not just the UI design, but also the UX design, uh, understand user experience, understand ergonomics and all that stuff. And full disclaimer, I am not UX UI designer. I am a mobile developer. I'm an iOS developer. I work with a lot of designers. I am interested in in the design, but like I am by no means a professional designer. I'm trying to get better at it. I I tried to get better at it because I do like UI and I do like UX. So design. You need to know how like design and the design goes beyond just your tools where you draw or put together um a prototype of a website or mobile app design goes into like human psychology how people see and interact and understand the information what certain aspects of your experience and UI can help user to navigate or motivate user to um, like uh, make user to trust you to trust your application especially if you are doing uh, paid services and things like that so and those are really really important things to understand what are the things the UX UI designer has to know so it is a tech career and you have to be technical so uh, one tool or well there are many tools that you need to know but let's start with figma figma is a tool where you can put together your design figma has libraries or already ready for you for for your use design for mobile and for web for example if you need to show where the um keyboard will come up for ios they have 
um, elements for that so you don't have to do it yourself if you need to show a native navigation items like nav bar or things like that you, you can also reuse that in, in that tool so and figma figma is free figma is an amazing an amazing tool another tool really really similar to figma is zeppelin zeppelin has a little bit more functionality it is not free you i think you have a trial but at some point you have to pay a license you have to pay subscriptions you also have to know or it's really good if you know other editing software in other words adobe photoshop it's it, it's it's good to know how to operate with those software because uh a, a part of ux ui design you have to be you have to be able to edit your design you have to produce um digital design and present it to like through to the team in um in the fashion that it can be usable for mobile developers you have to uh, be very specific about like colors do you want us to use what what size or uh, spacing and all that it's yeah, and those tools they're like rather easy So let's talk about programming language. Do you need to know a programming language as UX UI designer? Not necessarily. You can be a, an excellent UX UI designer without coding or not even knowing how to code. However, there are UX UI designers who are interested in coding. There are UX UI, for example, on the iOS side, I know of UX UI designers who know Swift and uh, picked up Swift UI just to create prototypes. And I think it's really awesome. Uh, some of the UX UI designers, they know CSS because you can do a lot of things with CSS. CSS is cascading style sheet. I talk about it in my last video about web development. So it is a plus. You, if you want to, you can code and uh, you can uh, develop a prototype in your code and you and and it's it's fun and uh, I think it's a little bit easier for mobile developers to dive into your code or uh, utilize some of your UI code that you created. I know of uh, an iOS developer who um, decided to be a UX UI designer and. Um, that person just creates prototypes using Swift, um, and I'm not sure if he if he uses Swift UI on, or UI Kit, but he just focuses on UX UI design and creates prototypes. So that this is what he does. So that's that's career. That's an option for you. UX UI designer in the in the, let's talk about industry now. UX UI designer is a pretty competitive industry. I would say it is very on demand. Um, every decent company needs a, a decent UX UI designer. Startups at some point at some point they would need your help to design your product, and so your product looks decent and. Um, in terms of the compensation, you can make pretty good money as a UX UI designer. How much it will depend, and I think there are levels of uh, UX UI designer. You can be principal product designer, you can be like just a regular UX UI designer, you can be junior UX UI designer. So, and it depends on the company, and there's definitely a career for you. And all of the big companies, such as Apple, Google, Netflix, Amazon, they all have UX, UI designers, and they have they not just one or two, they have entire teams of UX, UI designers. So this is this is a good field to be in if you um want if you're interested in the design. <laughs> Let's talk about how to get there, how you become UX UI designer. One of the paths that you can take is definitely go to college and study design and uh, 
um, fun fact from my past before, like a long time ago, I was uh, working as a sign language interpreter and I work with designers uh, at the university. I was interpreting lectures on design for designer students. So it's definitely one of the paths that you can take. Um, and again, similarly to software development, it's long, it's expensive, um, you're gonna learn a lot of stuff that you don't really need for your job. So you can certainly teach yourself design, but in design, I think, it's such a fine, uh, it's such a fine industry where like you definitely need to take knowledge and experience from other designers. So this is why a third option that I would recommend you to go to a design bootcamp. Yes, there are bootcamp for UX UI designers. Yes, it is an option. Yes, it is available for you. Again, such as with QA bootcamp, such as with coding bootcamp, do your research. Talk to people who graduated from from those boot camps. Their certification program. You don't have to have certificate to have, to be a UX UI designer, but those are options available to you. So, if you are a creative person, if you are into design, if you if you think that coding is not for you, you're more in the creative side. UX UI design might be for you. I work with a lot of designers and I am having a lot of fun talking with them, working with them, learning from them. So that career is absolutely amazing. So this is about it, about UX UI design. Let me know if you have any questions. And I think I'm going to pause my career in tech videos for right for right now let me know in the comments what career path you are interested in because we cover iOS development obviously we cover QA we cover web development and we covering right now UX UI design but there are so many other fields that you can go to you can um you can go to project management, you can be a business analyst, you can be a technical writer, you can be IT or system administrator or um, that person who um, configures laptops, configures machines and things like that. So you, you can do that. You can uh, do DevOps. They uh, maintain infrastructure and build CI, CD and pipelines. There are so many other options. And if you're interesting, if you're interested in hearing more about those options, let me know in the comments because I ran the poll on Twitter and I run poll on YouTube I have two different results. I have better participation on Twitter and uh, my audience on Twitter would like to hear more. My audience on YouTube is still voting. Definitely let me know what you think. Definitely let me know what video, what kind of video you would be interested in. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye y'all.